Thousands of people around the Bay Area don't have any power this morning still after the storm that we had yesterday. Now, as we've been talking about, yeah. most of the Bay Area is drying out right now, which is a good thing because they are trying to get power back on. And you're looking at a map here of the area that is effective. Um, this is what we're following live this morning with Sarah Stinson talking about when the lights come, might come back on well, let's hope because soon. we've got more rounds of rain and wind and everything else that's supposed yeah. to hit by Wednesday. Sarah, what's going on right now? Well, live in Crockett, where all morning it's been dark and the lights came back on. It's good news for people who live around here. There was a large portion of Crockett that was in the dark this morning. You can see the lights behind me actually turning red and people have been driving by me saying, we got the power back on. People are excited. It's not an easy thing to wake up on a Monday in general, let alone without power, trying to scramble, especially when you weren't prepared for that, like we are with the those uh, safety power shutoffs. So let's take a look at the map, though. So there's, we're still not out of the woods here. There's still about 12,000 plus customers, PG&E customers across the Bay Area that are without power right now, ranging from the East Bay to the North Bay, South Bay, you name it. Even in San Francisco, there's a few people without power right now. Uh, they are working on restoring power for everyone, but they've done a pretty good job because already half the people who were without power this morning now have it. Earlier, we were reporting nearly 21,000 customers without power, so half those people have the lights back on. The green and the green means smaller outages, and orange means bigger outages and the reason we have this outage is because of the rain we saw the rain came through very needed rain but I guess the power poles were not quite ready for it because they were damaged many power poles we're still waiting to get the exact number of damage throughout the Bay Area but definitely significant damage from that rain caused to pg e power transformers and poles causing this outage I mean there's nearly 5,000 customers without power alone on the peninsula and it continues throughout the bay area so they're working to repair everything hopefully they can have it repaired soon because earlier they were saying not till eight o'clock here in crockett but the lights are back on actually the middle school and high school here had to cancel class today because of this power outage and i wonder what they're going to do now because one hour later the lights are back on. Speaking of the lights, now the sun's out too, so we have the lights on overall. We'll keep you updated. I've been waiting to get an update from PG&E on when they think uh, they will have it restored, but clearly, Daria, they're making some really good progress. I'll send it back to you. All right, thanks a lot.